To perform this test, have your patient in prone position with both legs in neutral. The examiner flexes the knee of the hip to be examined to 90 degrees and palpates the greater trochanter of the hip on that side. Now perform internal and external rotation of the hip to determine the position in which the greater trochanter is parallel with the treatment bench, or in other words, when it reaches its most lateral position. In this position, the examiner uses a goniometer to measure the degrees of anti or retroversion in relation to the position that is perpendicular to the table. 10 to 15 degrees of antiversion is considered normal, so an angle greater than that would be considered a positive test indicating antiversion of the hip. And anything less than 10 degrees would be considered a positive test indicating retroversion of the hip joint.